All right, hello. Uh, here is a quick how to provision a Yealink T46 with our 3CX server. It's really quite easy. The first thing you need to do is get the IP address of the phone. In order to do that, um, there's an OK button in between all the arrows. Hit that. In my case, mine is 192.168.1.20. So you'll enter that. By default, all Yealink phones are admin, admin for username and password. So we'll enter that here and click confirm. Now in order to do the uh, provisioning of the phone or get it registered to the system, you're gonna need the provisioning URL and your IT or phone administrator should get that for you. If you don't have it, contact them and they'll get that for you. You're gonna wanna copy and paste that under Settings, I've just copied it, now I'm gonna paste it. Auto provision, and then right here where it says server URL, paste that right there. Okay, hit confirm, and hit auto provision now. And then click okay if you're prompted. Okay, now this could take a few minutes. Um, what it's doing is the phone is reaching out, trying to get the, is gonna get the configuration and basically auto provision. Um, it could take a good five minutes. Uh, so just be patient and you should be all set with if it within five or 10 minutes. If for whatever reason um, you wait five or 10 minutes and the phone still looks idle or nothing has happened, do reach out to your administrator because there could be some other issue involved. Um, but other than that, it should be fairly simple. All right, thanks, bye.